Hi, today's tutorial will be about Victoric fittings for firefighting pipes. In this channel, I'm sharing rivet tutorials for beginners. To get the full experience and full projects, you can join my courses on Udemy. You can find the course link in the video description. In this video, I will provide you the Victoric fittings rivet families and I will show you how to load the Victoric fittings for the firefighting pipes with diameter equal to 65 mm and above and four pipes with diameter 50 mm and less we will use threaded fittings as bare NFBA 13 first go to the video description download uh, the Victoric fittings go to downloads right click show in folder I will move it to the desktop extract the files Click OK and open the folder. As you can see, these are the fittings which we are going to use to define the firefighting pipes. Now go to Rivet, create a new uh, file, go to the uh, US metric and choose the plumbing default metric. Click OK and OK. Go to Systems to Pipes, draw any pipe in the workspace. Select the pipe, as you can see it's a single line pipe, change the detail level to fine, to see it as real pipe, select the pipe, we have two types over here, so uh, click on edit type, duplicate, and name it fire pipes, click OK, now we added a new name, a new type, uh, fire pipes, click on edit, Click segments and sizes. I want to define a new uh, catalog for the pipe. As you can see here, we have predefined catalogs for the pipes. So click on a new. For the material, I will create a new material. Type here steel. We have this one. Duplicate. Name it. Fire pipes. Change the color to red and here the surface pattern, the foreground and the background to red. In firefighting pipes, we use schedule 40, so choose schedule 40 and here steel carbon. Click OK. As you can see now, we have a new catalog fire pipes schedule 40. Click on OK. From here, choose fire pipe schedule 40. The minimum size for this pipe is 15 millimeter and the maximum size 200 millimeter. As you can see, we can choose another value, for example, 400 millimeter. Now, let's define the fittings. Go to load family from here. Click OK for now and OK. Change the color to shaded. As you can see now, the color is red fire pipes and the pipe segment fire pipe schedule 40 if the pipe segment over here is cover a so change it to fire pipes from here now let's define the fittings for the fire pipe fighting pipes i will use a uh, victoric fittings for pipes with diameter equal to 65 millimeter and above and for a uh, pipes with diameter equal to 50 and less I'm going to use the threaded fittings so go to the insert tab to load the family from this file from this folder firefighting pipes select the first one press keep pressing on shift hold your shift button on your keyboard and select the last one click on open to load them Now select the pipe, go to edit type, to routing preferences, from here, from this uh, window, we can define the fittings. Now for the elbows, with diameter equal to 15, to diameter equal to 50, we are going to use the threaded pipes, click on the plus, 
uh, to add a new uh, sizes for Victor Lake. As you can see, this is the Victor Lake elbow which we loaded from 65 millimeter to uh, 400 millimeter and click OK and let's see the results. Uh, first, I will model a pipe with diameter equal to 40, uh, less than 50 millimeter. So cho choose the fire pipes. Now go to uh, this diameter 40 and draw a pipe like this. As you can see, this elbow is the threaded one, threaded. Now I want to increase the diameter to be uh, this one, for example, 100. As you can see, we have the Victolic uh, elbow. Now let's complete the other fittings. Go to routing preferences. Here the, here the preferred junction type, T or tab. I will choose the T. For the junction, I will use the threaded for diameter, the same as the elbow, 15. And here 50. Click on the plus sign. Now for for the uh, diameter. 65 and above, I will use the T-Victolic. For the cross, we can use uh, the welded uh, fittings for all sizes. For the transition, the same. Use the threaded. So this is the way that we use to define uh, the fittings for the firefighting pipes. Click OK and OK. Now let's try to make a reducer in this pipe, draw pipe and make the diameter to be 65 for example. As you can see it's the, victu the victuling reducer. Draw a pipe, here the diameter. Uh, sorry, the reducer will be threaded reducer. So now we have the right setup for the firefighting pipes. You can use it in all your projects. Thanks for watching. If you are looking for a complete project, don't forget to join the MEB course on Udemy. And please share and subscribe.